What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Johnny coming at you with a quick rip of Topps Chrome 2024 Blaster Pack. I haven't opened any of these this year. Um, these cards always look good and I saw two or three boxes at my local Walmart today. I grabbed two, grabbed to the register and noticed they were $49. What the heck? So I put the other one back and got this just so I can show you guys what's going on. Maybe we'll get a great card. But $50 for a blaster box is unacceptable if you ask me. I mean, at that point, why not go buy a couple of hobby packs? Um, back in the day, maybe these things were a little bit more expensive. But I, I want to say they were never more than $30, $32, $35. So the fact that they are uh, this much, I will not be buying any more of these. So anyways, here we go. You're going to find two sepia or two pink refractors parallel inside. There's some of the 300 card base set. Um, there's some of the things you can expect to find. Let's go. All right. If I remember, you're not getting too many cards per pack. These are chromed out, so they're pretty cards. And usually Topps Chrome every year does the MVP. Whoever the MVP is, uh, they'll give you $20 per base card of the MVP. I think that's what it is. Well, let's get started, guys. You're only getting four trading cards per pack. Uh, looks like it says MVP buyback eligible. So first pack, let's see what we can get. $50, man, I still can't believe how expensive that blaster is. But this is what they're looking like. Beautiful cards, of course. It's your normal tops design, but chromed out. There's a uh, Cody Thunderburk rookie card. There's a Tyler Glass now. Two. There, it looks like we have an extra card in this one. Nemo. Boom. Well, there's a Sepia O'Neill Cruz, not too shabby. And then this is a Julio Rodriguez. Looks like this might be an insert card or something. All etch. That's pretty neat, man. That's a good looking card. We'll put that up there because it looks good. And there's that Sepia card. But other than that, first pack done. Next one. Yeah, you're only getting four cards. There was one two three five cards in that one so i like i said i don't know if one of those are due in each blaster there's basby rookie card mookie betts ruiz and there we go looks like some kind of wave refractor of yuki mastool and then we got dalton varsho pink parallel so there's the pink parallel cards they're saying that you should get two of next pack pack number three guys if you did get autographs baseball cards mostly baseball cards and good vibes hit that like button down there for me there you go there's a wyatt langford rookie card i know that's one of the main rookies we're looking for so uh wyatt langford thank you sir that's nice we got uh tristan cassis for the boston red sox zach wheeler for phillies and all hail aaron judge all right next pack there's Jose Rodriguez, a rookie card. Yenier Cano, gold cup card. Josh Hader. And then Vlad Guerrero, 1989 throwback, 35-year anniversary card. So uh, there's another one of the inserts that you can expect to find in these Topps Chrome 2024. Three more packs, guys. Thanks for keeping up here. We've got a Coco Montes rookie. An Austin Riley from a Braves. Nolan Arenado. We got five cards in this pack. Nolan Jones. There's our some kind of shimmer. And then Bo Bichette Sepia card. Very good. So again, a little bit of everything in this blaster. Like you said, there's your pink parallels. There's uh, we got a good rookie there. Got some wave uh gitches, got our sepias, and got that all etch insert card we got two more packs here we go owen white jung ho lee rookie brandon low that's a cool looking card nathaniel low and jose menendez pink parallel that's a really cool looking card there very neat not bad looking cards but i'm telling you it's not worth 50 bucks man you should be assured like an autograph or a numbered card for 50 bucks. If I have 50 bucks, I might as well buy some Bowman. There's Indy Rodriguez rookie card, Jack Ladier, Max Scherzer, 
and Jeff McNeil, guys. What do you think about this rip? Uh, what do you think about how they look? But I will take that uh, Wyatt Langford and that Julio Rodriguez. Guys, have a great week. Let me know if you see any in the wild, if you're going to get any. Johnny out.